What's up, YouTube? Real quick, I just wanted to show you guys my helmet cam setup and my mic setup. I'm using the Sony Action Cam. This is the HDR AS15 version with the Wi Fi. Picked this up for 130 bucks off Amazon. It is a couple miles old, but it works just fine. And I'm going to show you how to get the case to work so that you can actually get a mic into it. So, the first thing setting up the case, you got to pop out this little front uh, plate, just pull it right out. And then, what I did was drill a hole underneath here so that the mic can fit into the camera. It's really easy, it doesn't take too long. And then for mounting it, I use this uh, this little screw-in tripod clip that came with the camera. You stick this in, use like a quarter or something to get it tight. And then on the helmet side. I just use the curved adhesive mount from Sony that comes with the camera. All right. So now you can, and then on the camera, you actually want to take off the that bottom sleeve. You just undo these two screws right here on the bottom, and then it pulls right out, and then just put the screws back in. The first thing you want to do is put the little anti-fog sheet in the back so that you can still actually work the button because there's a little bit of a clearance problem since your buckle isn't going to be done. So I just get it positioned right here in the back so that it's over top of this little push button. I'll go ahead and slide your camera in and put the cover on. I just keep this plastic piece on and I just slide it in the side here and then twist the cover on. And now, just because I like to, I put this rubber band on to keep this cover on here. But when you put the mic jack in, it'll actually keep the camera in place. You don't have to worry about the camera falling out if you don't want to use the cover and the rubber band. And now this is solid. So now I'm going to show you guys the mic and I'll show you how it goes together. I bought one of these cheap mics off of Amazon. It was five for I think seven bucks. It says on here newer with two E's. Good mic. So for the mic, I took it down the back. Here's the mic. Took it down the back of the helmet, comes right inside of this little weather stripping, and then I just fold it underneath so that it goes all the way to the ear pad. And I don't know if you guys can see in here, it comes under the ear pad in here, and then it comes out right here in the ear pad. It just tucks right in here so you don't get any wind noise from it being in the front, right in here. All right, so when you're putting the camera on top, just slide that, that mic, slide the mic jack right through that hole you drilled into the bottom of your camera. Take it up top and slide it right on. And then I like to just tuck this in a little bit more so that the wire's tight. And then up top, I'll stick this wire right in this little gap right here so it's not flapping around. And that's what it looks like. It's pretty good. This way I can use the Sony action camera with a mic. Still in the waterproof housing even though it's not very waterproof anymore. But it'll be weatherproof and the video looks great coming out of this and the sound is very good. So a lot of people say that they don't like the Sony camera 
because of the limited mounting options. But as you can see, mounting it on top of your helmet works just fine, especially with a mic. And I've seen other people use GoPro adapters to mount them on the side of their helmet using the tripod mount on the bottom of the case. And that way you can also drill a hole in it and put a, um, put a mic in. Or you can just not use the case and use a little Velcro like I've seen a couple of guys do on the side of your helmet. And that holds it just fine and you can use the mic without having to drill into any of your cases. But if you guys have any questions about the camera let me know and I'll be happy to answer them. Like, rate, subscribe, and thanks for watching. If you guys want to see a review of my helmet, click right here. If you guys want to see a review of the Sony Action Camera, click right up here.